Hello everyone, welcome to the stream. So today I'm going to be playing this Stardew Valley. I've never played it before. I've heard a lot about it, so you know what? I thought I'd give it a go. So let's let's get into it. Let's see what it's all about. It looks quite fun. It looks quite charming, to be fair. So I'm excited to try this one out. So any help would be greatly appreciated. So feel free to. Leave any tips in the comments section. Let's go. Right, it's a name. I'm gonna go Sam Crow. Does anyone know why? Does Sam Crow ring a bell to anyone? If you don't know, it's an acronym of Sons of Anarchy. It stands for Sons of Anarchy Motorcycle Club Redwood Originals. Now I did say to myself, every time I play a new game now, I'm going to be um, calling my correct characters Sam Crow. So there you go. Um, farm name. Um, let's call, what should we call? What should we call the farm? Um, Thing. Let's say, what's my favourite thing? Gaming. Oh, we're gonna do. I'm gonna be a dude. Okay. Nice little 16-bit graphics. So I'm gonna loosely base him on myself, I think. So there we go. Skin 17. I think that's. Pretty much me, isn't it? There's a lot of skin colours actually, considering. Hair, um, okay. Nice little afro. Go for the mullet, maybe. Emo. Hmm. I used to have that in the old day. Not that. <laughs> Emo hair. It's a lot of hairstyles. It's a lot more in depth than I imagined originally thought, to be fair. I'm going to start with that one. Yeah, I like a black t shirt normally, but that's quite me actually. Skull. Obviously, no, there's only four to choose on that way. That's right. Uh, bit of a beard. I haven't got a full on beard, got a little bit. Is that a duck beak? <laughs> Bar, I think. That's kind of like 
go to, I guess. Similar to what I've got. Yeah, let's go number five. Right, animal preference. Cat. Dogs. Oh, I love them all, actually. Cats and dogs. That's, that's quite harsh. Um, well, because I've got a dog, I've got a golden lab. Well, I've got seven cats as well. But uh, I'm going to go for like a yellow sort of lab looking dog because he's the newest addition to our family and he's only six months old. What's gaming, what is this game like? It seems pretty cool so far, I mean I'm just creating a character but what I've seen on it, it's uh, like a farming sort of game with its own little story, you have little quests to do and tend to your farms and kind of thing like that, I mean I'm going to learn the ropes as I go but it does look fairly interesting to be fair. Let's go dark jeans. So goth. Right, let's never choose a farm. Standard farm, simple plot of land. Hang on. spread across several islands, forest farm, the woods limit your space, rocky terrain, make it difficult to design your farm, plenty of good land here but beware, and night monsters come out, it's like, uh, reminds me of Minecraft, four parcels each with its own perk, perfect for a group, or beach farm, good foraging and fishing, and tons of open space, so I'm going to go for the first one, because I feel like that's what, that's probably a good start. Alright, let's see what let's see what this is about. And for me, very special grandson. I want you to have this sealed envelope. Cheers, Grandad. You know you look like Father Christmas, but ingrained. Now listen close. All right, I'm listening. You should probably turn the fire out when you go to sleep. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. Yeah. And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my boy, y'all be ready for this gift. Y'all. Let Grandpa rest. All right, James. So we start off. What well, we're working in an office, and is it like a dead end job or something? Where the jobs are just, you know, disappearing. Life's better with Jojo. Is that me? There I am. Isn't it? Is that me? Yeah. Oh, he's shaking. Was he furious? It's your letter. Dear Sam Crow, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy, Pop and Fresh Farm, is located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name. Hang on a minute. They spell honor wrong. In English way, anyway. Need a U after the second O. You will honour the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. <laughs> P.S. Blues is still alive. Say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Uh, yeah, okay. Lewis, Lewis, remember Lewis. Okay. 
I'll remember. Well, at least I'll try anyway. Ooh, look, it's a bus. Can we jump out now? <laughs> Bit of GTA. Stardew Valley is 0.5 miles away. Hello, you must be Sam Crow. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here, if you're following me. Alright then, Robin. So, is this our place? Let's have a look. This is Pop and Fresh Farm. Oh no, oh no. Look. Look at that. <laughs> Does that mean he's thirsty? What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Easy. And here we are, your new home. Lewis. Ah, the new farmer. <laughs> Hello, Lewis. Welcome. I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. Is it worth being a mayor? This place looks tiny. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house, very rustic. Yeah. That's right. Rustic. That's one way to put it. Crusty. Might be a little more apt though. <laughs> Rude! Don't listen to her, Sam Crow. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied. Dissatis dissatisfied. Fuck. <laughs> so that you buy one of our house upgrades. Ooh. She sussed you out, any. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Alright. I almost forgot, if you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here and I'll come by during the night to collect it. Or in, that seems fair enough. Oh, I almost forgot. Oh, I've already said that. Say, I've already forgot that. Duh. Well, good luck. Thanks, mate. <laughs> Rusta. Alright, so, WASD is move. Shift is run. Cool. If I hold shift, he walks. Okay, never mind. <clears throat> As we get to design our home a little bit. So obviously there's the shortcuts. Axe, hoe. Hoe. Watering can, pickaxe and scythe. Scythe. So let's hit this with an axe. No? What about number two? I mean, I did, I just want to pick it up. I'll right click, parsnip seeds, and a new journal entry. So you received 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started, Mayor Lewis. Well, oh, thank you very much. Um, can I put 
put it down. Put it down, then how do you? Press six. Oh, that's why, because I had got it. Got it, got it, got it. Um it's a there. The rug can sit in the middle. How do we rotate? Can we rotate the bed? Any anybody know? If uh, you can rotate items, oh, we'll leave that there for a minute. Stones. Okay, yep, yeah, makes sense. Can't you just break everything? <laughs> Just to clear up, <laughs> clear up areas. In a strange way, it's weird. No, that doesn't work. I don't know if that makes sense, but you know, just clearing up areas to make it all clean, so you can <laughs> use it later. I don't know. It sounds dark, but. Axe isn't strong enough to break this stump. That's fine. I didn't. I didn't even want to break the stump anyway. So. So, two is the axe. No, it's not. Two is the hoe. <laughs> hoe. Let's get the old scythe. Let's clear out the trees. Oh, that's satisfying. Just wiping there. Ooh! That's satisfying. Obviously, starting with fun. Clear. Trees. Is that number four, isn't it? 
use the chocolate, so it should be that one. Yeah, that's, that's the one. And then if we could just break some more of these rocks, just probably these ones here, to be honest. And then back to the axe to take out the wood. Can I break the tree? I'll keep hitting it. There it goes. <laughs> Indeed you can. Oh, gee. I just realised I've got energy. You're starting to feel exhausted. Whoops. What am I going to do? Hmm? What happens if you get exhausted? You feel sluggish and overexertion. Nah, don't. Oh, yeah, he does. Look how slow he's walking. Oh, what do I do? Should we go to bed? Oh, no, 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 what do you do now? Help. Somebody help. If you're watching and you know, please tell me. Do I go to bed? Smash the bed, Jesus. Go to sleep for the night. Yeah, got him. Progress has been saved. Right, now energy's gone up, well, pretty much half. Close this half, right? Okay, okay, okay. Let's find out what my buttons do. So, ease your inventory. Oh, and your skills, and that's no, a bit of everything, really. Okay, so there's my map. Crafting, collections, options, oh, auto runs on. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. Oh, don't want to quit. Cool, so that's E. T is text. Hello! M's map. Is your journal. Yeah, so if you want to become a farmer, you have to start with basics. Use a hoe to, to till the soil, then use a seed packet on the tilled soil to sow a crop. Water it every day until the crop is ready to harvest. Alright. It would be nice to just to introduce yourself around the town. Some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer. Okie dokie. It's about parsnips, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. Oh, we're going to need more than that. Oh, okay. Can't get much in there. So, let's uh, <coughs> expand on this. <laughs> I don't think we've got enough room. Close enough. That's why. Can I pick that up? No, we're gonna just have to have them looking a bit dumb right now. Let's get to water. <laughs> kind of reminds me of um a little bit of Animal Crossing in a weird way. <clears throat> so we're going to need to find a place where we can um, fill up the water. Comes back in half as a parsnip. And then go and talk to people, I guess. Hello, just got back from a fish trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Willie. Oh, 
Oh, I'm willing. Let's see what I can do. Where's the beach? All the way down there. Grab the laugh. <clears throat> oh, let's go for a little wonder. If I'm not stuck, that is. There we go. So we've left the farm. Radish there. Mm. I was all thinking with your thinking with your Robin. Have I met everyone? No. Yeah, good looking there, but obviously not. Am I near the beach? Getting there, I think. Oh, hello. You aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Uh, hey, Jody. Ooh, I can read it in your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're looking for something to do in the evening, stop by. The saloon, that's where I work. Oh, I am. Near the saloon. There's another person here. Ah, uh, Mayor Luce told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie. Oh, hello, Marnie. I'm looking for the beach. Can you point me into the general direction of the beach? <clears throat> oh, hey there, son. Oh, there is a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Come on, mate. I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Okay. I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe we'll buy something from the shop once in a while. I do. Maybe. A bamboo pole. Um. Cook coal. Obviously, I haven't unlocked that row. I don't think. There's a good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, sir. Come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what my old pappy used to say anyway. If it smells, it sells. I don't think that would be the case in all industries. <laughs> oh. oh, that's the power of it. You're starting to feel exhausted. Oh, you're damn right I am. So, what, what is the case of, like, you wait for it to rattle? Is cool. See, this looks interesting. Oh, <laughs> I threw my fishing rod at it. That's uh, pretty wise, yeah. I mean, that's good. You can carry stuff and eat it, so I might eat that because my energy is really low.
Although that's hardly done anything to be honest. Although, does running take energy? So I think as long as you're not like doing chopping or breaking or anything, you should be alright. I'm assuming. Yeah, still on nine, I've done a little bit of running now. Oh, hello. Elliot. Ah, the new farmer. We've all been expecting. And whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure is. Hmm, <laughs> we've found a piece of wood. This could be fixed. We only have 33. We ain't fixing shit. Right, let's, let's head back out. What's this way? So if we carry on heading right. Looks like a kitchen there. Closed until summer. So I hear that you go through seasons on this game. Every 28 game days in a game. No, start again. Every 28 days in game. It's a season, so I've heard. Hello Vincent. Don't talk to strangers. Absolutely right. Hello kid. Jazz. Oh Jazz. And Penny. Hello, I'm Penny. Oh, hello Penny. I don't know why I'm talking about in between us. Hello Sheriff. Gunther. <laughs> hello there, welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeological Office. Uh, this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for the display, but I'm hoping that it remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Um, no, probably not. <laughs> no, I might do. Unlucky black cat. Hello. <laughs> Hello to you too, mate. How's it going? Hope you're well. I've literally no idea what I'm doing, so... Try not to laugh. For the first time ever playing this, so I'm just trying my luck, really. <laughs> I'm just supposed to be finding people to talk to. It says, greet 28 people. I've managed to find 10 so far. But I literally don't know what I'm doing. I think I've spoke to these guys. Yeah, I've spoke to those. What's this like? Blacksmiths, this one. There's another person to talk to. Oh, I didn't mean to sit down. Does that count as talking to somebody? No, it doesn't actually. That's a shame. <laughs> You're not good enough friends with Clint to enter his bedroom. It's probably a good thing. <laughs> Don't worry, uh, entering strangers' bedrooms. It's kind of frowned upon, I think. <laughs> Join us, Fry, at the Yoja Mart. Hello, Pam. Hey, kid, the name's Pam. Um, hey, Pam. Don't be a jerk and we'll get along fine. <laughs> I'll try not to. Did that count? Yes, it did, thankfully. I won't buy anything just yet, because I don't know what I need to buy, so I'm just... Exploring. Hello, Morris. How are you doing today? I don't believe we've met. I'm Morris. Yoja, 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 customer satisfaction representative. When you decide you want to become a Yoja member, I'll be delighted to help make your transition a joyous experience. Well, thank you very much, sir. Shane's hard at work. He doesn't seem interested in talking. Where's Shane? Is he hiding in the freezer? No, oh, no, wait. That was Shane, wasn't it? Don't. Oh, 
Right, what's this way? That's a new person, isn't it? I don't remember talking to him. Oh, that is Shane. <laughs> what? What do you want? Go away. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's right. It counted to another number to our objective. Talk to 28 people, so we've managed to talk to 12 so far. Nothing up here, clearly. Do you wait up? I want to talk to you. Why does my character look like Tom Green? I mean, I made the guy. <laughs> he just reminds me of Tom Green. Oh, where'd he gone? Where'd he gone? Where'd he gone? Maru. Oh, aren't you the new one who just moved in? Yes. Yes, I am. And this is... Demetrius. Greetings, I'm Demetrius. Local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. That's all right. Thank you. That's another one I've seen there. I don't know what these do. These statues. So I managed to find one so far on the beach. But I literally have no idea what this one does. I'll probably find out. This guy looks like a caveman. Linus. Stranger, hello. Ooh, hello. <laughs> Just walk into his tent. Oh no, stop. <gasps> oh my god. He's chasing me into the tent. Leg it. Oh my god. That was scary. So, what's that, 13? 15? Oh, good. Well, 13 left at least. This is a uh, home again, isn't it? Yeah. It is. So, I've just come up the back road. So, there's a exit to the right. So, I might be able to go down there. See what's going on there. Might be interesting. Jamie Byrne has liked the stream. Thank you, Mr. Jamie Byrne, for liking the stream. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. It's getting late. On the game, anyway. Yeah, it's only like half eleven at night in England. Um, assuming most people have probably gone to bed, so maybe I should go to bed. It's locked. Yeah, nine till three. But something here I can read. Trying to keep the art of fishing alive, I'll pay 120g to any fisherman who catches free sardine. Good luck, Willie. Yeah, I'll accept it. But where would I find sardine? <laughs> what I'll do first, though, I think um, I'm going to get some sleep. Water the crops in the morning. Yeah. So we're back up to half energy, which isn't too bad. I don't plan on doing much chopping or anything at the moment. Oh, it's raining. We've got a letter though. Oh, it's an advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. 
stop by PS General Store today and check out our affordable 24 size backpack. See you soon. That would be quite handy. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, I don't think I need to water these, surely. When it's raining. End up just wasting the water, otherwise. So we're probably going to go and look at finding some more people, I guess. Because I think last time everyone disappeared to bed. So. Well, we've got a couple of hours before the uh, shop opens. Because it's only ten past seven. So I was like, sit and wait. No, that'd be silly, wouldn't it? Yeah, it's absolutely empty. I think, uh, I think I've got up too early. And everyone's still in bed. Or at home, at least. Probably eating their breakfast. Although, the clock spins around pretty quickly. Look, it's nearly 8 o'clock now, so. And this place opens at... Nine, I believe. Yes. Oki Doki and Pierre's, I'm assuming it also opens at nine, is closed on the Wednesday. What? <laughs> I just accidentally put water on his door. Oh, hello. Are you new? Shane. No, he's the uh, grumpy supermarket worker, isn't he? He didn't like me talking to him last time. Don't know why. I only said hello to him. And he got the ump. Right, we've got another ten minutes. open. So what's this place? So this is Haley's house. And that's Emily's bedroom. Okay. They're clearly not in. We go into this one. Kids in bed. Oh, is he getting out of bed? No, come outside. Go on. Let me talk to you. Because that's not creepy, is it? You wake up and there's someone sitting in your living room. Go on. Can I talk to you? I won't lie, that would have certainly freaked me out a little bit. Come on, come on, Sam. I oh, mean, he's not buying it, he's not interested. This is a new guy, Lewis. Oh, it's not, it's Lewis. <laughs> oh, it's Lewis. Your grandpa used to complain about the wickety old bed, but I think deep down he actually loved that house. I'm sure, he did. I'm sure, he did. I think it's almost time for another drink, if I'm being brutally honest. Alright, let's, let's check the pharmacy. At least, hopefully, I can talk to a couple of people. Can I just talk? No, it's only asking me to buy stuff. No nurses. You're not good enough friends with Harvey to enter his bedroom. Who has a bedroom in a pharmacy? Harvey, apparently. Which is funny because my brother's name is Harvey. <laughs> I 
Hello, sport. Alex. Oh, hey, so you're the new guy, huh? Cool. Yeah, cool. There's two people here, which is good. I didn't mean to attack them. George, it's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. <laughs> what, has she nicer? Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. Um, okay, Granny. Okay. <laughs> 18, we've got 10 more to go. 10 more to go. Oh, he's in a wheelchair. I didn't realise that. Excuse me, madam. Can I have a word? Pam. Oh, we spoke to Pam, haven't we? Oh, Pam. What about you? Have we spoke to you? Penny, yeah. We spoke to Penny. Where is everybody? I mean, I guess I don't have to sit here and talk to everyone in this first sitting. Maybe the idea is that you actually meet people as you progress through the game. I could do some fishing. I not spoke to this guy. No. Yeah, let's have another quick look. We've got fishing. Trying to keep out of fishing log, I'll pay 120g to any fisherman who catches three sardines. So maybe we're going to go and explore and do some fishing. So I'm guessing when it wobbles or something. No, I heard like a noise. If anyone's watching, please tell me how to fish. It's making little noises. And little bubbles. Oh, what was that? Um, click the raise the bar, raise the lower the bar, keep the bar behind the fish. What? Oh, behind is in. Yeah. Visually, not underneath it. Please be a sardine. Sunfish. Got my first fi uh, fish. So they're after some sardine. Maybe they're at the beach. Because that's where I spoke to uh, the sailor. Come on. Bite for me. Bite. Mm -hmm. There we go. Oh, this one's a lot quicker. So that bar goes down if you come off it. Quite like that. Ah, bit of a challenge. So we've got a small mouth bass, not a loud mouth bass. Um, I really need a backpack, but obviously being Thursday, being a Wednesday, I can't get a backpack. I'm going to go to the beach. So we're quite near the beach, so I won't have too far to go. Was that the, uh, the pirate? Well, you love pirate. Probably wasn't, but <laughs> he looked like one. So I'm going to see if I can get some sardine here. Let's try. God, what a rainy day. See, the pharmacist is shot already. Nine to three. Like, Days do go quick on here. Come on, bite for me. Woo! Is that another small mouth bass? Come on, when it goes to the bottom, it's not letting you grow your green bar. Oh, he's a fidget, this one. Come on. I'm nearly there. <laughs> this one is being a right little fidget. Keep still, will you? Ah. It's 
Stop it. <laughs> you asshole. At last. <laughs> and we got a sardine. That's good. That's good. Exactly what we wanted. Right. I'm literally going to be back in 15 seconds. So I'm going to hit that beer right back screen. We're back. Just get him off still for Dwink. Look, I don't know if I was longer or shorter than the uh, 15 seconds, but <laughs> nice. So let's see if we can get ourselves another sardine. Although I don't have the space. We'll ditch it for the sunfish, though. Sorry, some fish all down in the bin. Oh, that's a scary noise. Oh, that's a very weak throw. So I want to see if I can get myself another sardine. No, sorry, Mush. <laughs> You're going to straight in the bin. Yeah. Try again. Yeah. See if we get ourselves a sardine. Yeah. Playing games, but I heard a noise. Who's that man? I want to talk to you. Come back. Oh, sorry. Catch this side thing. Which I hope it is anyway. Oh, there we go. Got that one. Hey. Surely you can duplicate, right? Oh, really? Um. Oh, that's not. That's not good. Um, let's get rid of the trees. I mean, I don't have a Unless I can eat some. Yeah, before we do any more fishing. Can I just pick pick them up and eat them? I don't want to hit it. <laughs> oh, man. Um, Right, let's see if I can sell the sardine. Or do I have to do all three at once? Ah, oh, we're too late. I need a backpack and all. Tell you what, let's get to sleep. We'll come back here. Hopefully, that stays out of sap. Oh, look, little pokey things. ourselves a book. We found a lost book. The library collection has expanded. Oh, wicked. I <laughs> didn't even mean to do that. Now these things I'm very curious about. Yeah, we've got two out of three, which is good. This must be the cemetery. Our beloved Muda. One of those ghosts on here. So, yeah, we're back at the 
farm. <coughs> Can we go in here? It's a lot. Of, uh, six o'clock. See, we're missing all the windows. So yeah, the days go pretty quick. Not gonna lie. I don't want to waste energy if I can help it. I want to see if I can get past this lot. It's over that way, isn't it? To the right. Hear that noise. It's quite terrifying. Ooh. Oh, it's in the way. Ah, uh, what a rock. There we go. That's fine. So, it's going to be a new day when we go to bed. Hopefully, it's not raining. has been saved. Does it only save when you go to bed? Oh crap. It just attacked my crop. What a dick. We're running out of water as well so I don't know where we're going to find the water. Anyone can point it out. I'd very much appreciate it. Thank you. Oh, I stopped putting water in the in the chest. What's wrong with you? Um, put fibre in there. The stone and the wood. Because I don't think I need it right now. How do I get it back? It's right there. Have I lost those other things? Do you know what? I think I've lost the stone and the fibre. Have I? Anyone? Help! Please advise. <laughs> Stop hitting everything. You're like a child who just wants to smash everything up. Let's go and see if we can buy a backpack. That'd be a good start. Obviously, we've got to wait until what, nine o'clock? That's when the shop's open. But energy is looking good, though, today. Obviously, I didn't use a lot yesterday. Where are we? We're Thursday the 4th. We're in spring. And we've got people's birthdays to remember. Mm. So friendly little community, isn't it? Where they uh, sit in the room with people's birthday. Oh, it's raining. Oh, well, it's just a case of waiting for a moment, really, while we're... just until we get to 9 o'clock, I think. Too long. It's not an hour to go. But I said they go pretty quick on here, so. Alex, I think that's Penny, isn't it? 
like a sock psycho. I heard the door shut. Quick, get him! Oh, that's grumpy, uh... Sean? Shane? What do you want? Leave me alone. You're so grumpy. Here we go. Nine o'clock. Let's get ourselves a backpack. Why, hello there, sir. I am looking for a backpack. Seeds, seeds, sugar, wheat flour, rice, oil, vinegar, wallpaper, flooring, catalogue. Um, I don't see a bag. I'm sure this was the place. Help. There it is. Backpack upgrade. Purchase for 2,000. I don't even have 2,000. I've only got 500. Ooh. Wait, where's my fishing challenge gone? So, are you saying that I don't need to do it anymore? Because it seems like that. It's locked. 12 o'clock to 12. Makes sense. Being a pub. So I have a feeling that that fishing challenge was just for one day only. I'm thinking I've missed my window for that one. Yes, it looks like it's completely gone. Let's get on the bus. Or not. He does not want to go on the bus. Out of order. It is a bit out of order. What's this? bus to Calico Desert is out of service. What kind of place is this? Hmm? Dandelion, dandelion. Eat it. Yeah, go on in. 25 energy. Dandelions are good. I don't want it yet, I just want to pick it up. Uh, daffodil. this tree. It's really like Animal Crossing. You obviously have to craft your... Oh, that's a lot of stuff. You have to craft your um, items. You, you know, your axes and that. Pickaxes. But I'm assuming on this, it's just energy related. Which is probably better. It saves you having to, like, constantly... Having to craft new items. I want to see if I can sell some of these daffodils, dandelions. I'm assuming you can. Welcome to Pierre's. There we go. That's good. Even the mix seeds. Yeah, I'm trying to pick up enough money now so I can buy the backpack, which is two grand. You have I spoke to you, Abigail. No, I don't think we have. I don't think we spoke, have we? Pretty cool. So how many people is that now? 19, so just another 9 to go. Oh, 
honestly. Don't you think that my character looks like Tom Green from the side? <laughs> he just reminds me of Tom Green. I suppose, is that a big... Uh, Caroline. Hello, Caroline. No, I know you. I know who you are, mister. Lewis, isn't it? What the? Have I spoke to you? Jody. Tiny son chasing that. Yes. <laughs> Don't you think? Oh. Just from the side, it's supposed to be like a reflection on me. But it looks just like Tom Green. <laughs> yeah, I've called him Sam Crow, but on reflection, I should probably call him uh, Tom Green. <laughs> it's funny, if, if only that song was Sardine, because I was hunting for free sardines earlier. Only Leah's friends can come here. Okay. Well, I've got some fish to sell. Let's do a bit more fishing. I'm gonna try and sell those fish. Come on, bite. Bite fishy. Now oh, I picked up some algae. Algae. Oh, I did. I got fish. Sells a sunfish. Ugh. More our guy. God, no. That proper told me them. Where'd that go? <laughs> oh, he's a fidget, this one. Keep still then. Oh, I could never be a fisherman. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Sit still where we are. Oh my god. I've lost it. You stupid fish. What happened here? Let's try again. There we go, you got a bite. Oh, he jumped. Whee! That's another one. Another sunfish. Right. Now, I am going to smash up some wood. Telemetry, so I won't be able to pick that up. Boy, no, I'm just after the wood. Okay, so 
So, as soon as everything closes at like five o'clock, I might as well go to bed. That's actually, tell a lie. I'm going to the pub. Plus, should meet a host of people in the pub, right? Surely. You. Have I spoke to you? Sam. Hello, Sam. Yes, you're the guy that's in bed. So that should now be 21. You it is. Yay. Where's the pub? Good evening. Why, hello there, Thar. Get pretty lovely and nice. Sometimes we even put coin in the jukebox. Hmm, <laughs> fascinating. But uh, this was fascinating. The town's lost and found box. Oh, okay, fair enough. Oh, that person up there. You look new. Are you new, Clint? I can't remember. I spoke to Clint. Apparently not. That's 22 now. And now we're going for a beer. Have I spoke to you? Pam? Yeah, I think I have. Gus, have I spoke to you? Emily, you think I have. That's the brother spoke to, isn't it? Yeah, Clint spoke to him. That's Alex, I think. Why don't we let me talk to him? He's quite grumpy, it seems. I win him over, though. Oh, what's this? Oh! A little uh, mini game. Slightly better that time, but still not great. It's an extra life. <laughs> Space item, but I don't, I don't think I've been picking up items. space then but I just don't think I've got anything. I thought I picked up like a bunch of ammo but space, there we go. <laughs> so he ran a bit faster into an enemy. We're done. What's this one like? There's a skull shaped keyhole. So I don't think we can play that one. Unless we get ourselves a skull shaped keyhole. So that's the main menu music. Can I sell you anything? No. Am I going to buy anything? Also, no. That be said, let's 
Let's go to bed. I'm slowly getting to grips with the lo location of this area now. At least I can crawl home from the pub. Okie dokie. Let's get some sleep. Oh, don't walk out again. Yeah, time for bed. Oh, at least we've leveled up our fishing. So the uh, fishing rod proficiency is plus one. Pretty good, yeah. Pretty good. Day four of spring, year one. Cool. Cool. Don't know what that means, but cool. Day five of spring, year one. Jarusta. Oh. Alright, see. There must be a water tap somewhere. I've oh, got a letter there as well, which I'll check out in just a moment. Yeah, I'm out of water now. Where's the water tap, man? Is it in my house? Surely you think there's a tap in here. Ladies and gentlemen, he lives in a house without a toilet or any source of water. And that was his granddad's house. I think his granddad's stitched him up big time here. Right, what's the letter say? To our valued Yo-Yo Mark customers, our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal pursuant to Enid. L61091 Joji Co Amendment responsible to stewardship of the local environment is our top priority. We apologise for any inconvenience this accident may have caused. As always, we value your continued support and patronage. Morris. Oh. Thank you, Morris. That's very useful to know. I wonder if um the uh, shops are open in different time zone in different seasons. What's that? It looks like manure. It looks like crap. That's because it is Austin. No, was it? This coffee tastes like shit. That's because it is Austin. Oh, I'm glad it's not just me then. I don't want to even talk to you. You're a grumpy old git. It's locked. Can't go to the sewers just yet then. <laughs> but I found myself. Get get into the beach. I'm hoping I can sell the fish here. Makes sense. I spoke to you everyone. Oh, that's all Willy. It's locked. Nine o'clock. Well, it's nearly time. Nearly time. Oh, I've got some fish for you, Willy. Some sardine. Some sunfish and another sardine. Still not quite enough though. So let's do a bit more fishing. Have I got a new objective? No, not quite. Cultivate and harvest a parsnip. I think we're just having to wait for that one really. Hopefully it'll be easy to catch a few fish now because like I said my proficiency's gone up.
You got a point. And we've got ourselves. And I get it. We got ourselves another sardine. Not bad that. If I remember correctly, that was 50, wasn't it? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. What am I doing? What am I doing? Got a bite, Joey. Nice. And we've got a herring this time. So let's collect the number two fish. I guess we've got space for, and then I'll sell them. Too bad, though. Got a shield and another Shoy Dean. That's a move location, just in case. Oh, come on. Trash. Where can I sell that? You. I haven't spoke to you. I'm sure I haven't. <laughs> what a weird thing to say. Now don't throw a fishing water. Elliot. I thought it was a chick. I have spoke to him. Waste of my fishing time. Right, here we go. Sardine, let's go. No, we've got room for together one because they're actually piling up here. Though. That's good, that's good. That's very good. What have we got this time? It's a fidget. Sardine. Nice. So we could get another two of those because obviously three is an infantry. Okay, this one's nice and easy. Didn't even break a sweat. Perfect. A seven inch sardine. But why can't go there. Oh, I get it. Is that his rating? Gold. Yes, that makes sense. Alright. Alright, before I do that. Sell three sardine, a herring, a silver sardine, and a gold sardine, which is 60. Cool, cool, cool. Let's do a bit more. I need 2,000. So I'll get myself that backpack. Regular. Right, 
Got him. This time we've got ourselves a herring. Come on, bite. There it is. <laughs> Great. Seaweed. <laughs> Just what I wanted. Oh, we'll use a quick move off. Oh, what's that? Oh. Oh. What happened there? I think I broke it. I was hoping to pick up that treasure chest. Does anybody know what that would have done? If I didn't screw it up so bad. So this is a sardine, one inch sardine, sorry. I can't imagine that going for much money. Unless it's worth a lot, then that's good, but I don't think it will be. Oh, that's a new one. A flounder. Five inches. Well, I'll do this one, and then we're going to sell some. If he's still open. Yeah, I think he shuts at five, doesn't he? Soggy newspaper. Lovely. It's quick. No, 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 no. Let's get in the shop. Sell the fish. And a flounder's worth a hundred. Nice. Stop throwing your fishing rod at things. You doofus. It's uh, disappeared now. A cola can. <laughs> B. Flawless. Flawless. Victory. Outstanding. Stop throwing the fishing rod at the shop. What a dumbass. Stupid dumbass. Come on. Ourselves another sardine. So I'm assuming if you're fishing ponds and rivers, you're likely to get different fish. So uh, obviously these are all sea fish. One would assume anyway. Sardine. So I'm sure last time I went up to that chest, 
and collected it, it didn't work, but... Okay. Okay. Got a 12 inch herring. Sub that for the, the can. Okay. And that's probably going to do for that for now. Well, let's eat that anyway. Yeah, let's eat it. Yummy. Although, crispy seaweed from a Chinese restaurant. It's alright. I'm not gonna lie. It's actually alright. Salty. So, if you don't mind salty food, then. Yeah. It's alright. Should we eat some green algae? Is that going up? Yeah. Alright. An ornamental fan. Cool. Doop, doop. Out of water. So how do we get water? That's what I want to know. Like this. You beauty. It's exactly how you do it. So, we can go to bed and then water our crops in the morning. I mean, I was tempted to stay up all night. See what happens. Stay up late in the graveyard. Uno do you do something snaz up hump or today now do small view Lonzo Yen how I like tall You know what I completely agree hundred percent agree with that Definitely So we only got five more people to talk to to complete that little challenge And I'm assuming I can't get go to people's houses at this time of night, surely. Yeah, well, that's, I think that's a shot, but still. You know what I mean. Okay, let's do, let's do a little bit of fishing in uh, my pond. <laughs> See if we get a different type of fish. Anything? Crash. Wonderful. Try again. Mm -hmm. oh, premature. A broken CD. I'm sure it's going to be worth thousands. I want a fish. Give me a fish. Trash again. Give me a fish. Let's 
getting late. Yeah, sure is. He's a sleepy one. Oh, I'll give up. See if there's any additional settings I could play around with. So uh, we should probably go to bed now. Again, stop throwing your fishing rod at the buildings. Oh, let's grab some sleep. It's now Saturday. Is that ready? I think that's ready, you know. But what is this? Because last time I opened that. Doing that. Hmm. You lose things putting it in there though, that's the thing. Gunther. Oh, I'll keep the ornamental, ornamental fan then. Because a blue old Gunther will tell us about that. Um, so what, let's do that again, siding. I can pick up a crop now. Okay. Does so anyone go to it again? Yes, yeah, so I can pick it out. But I think it's only one item. I think. <laughs> Passing it. So as you look again. Experience, you'll discover new craft recipes to increase profit and make life easier. Scarecrow, for example, will prevent crows from snacking on your precious crops. Roost farming level 1 and craft scare scarecrow. Cool. 100G for that. Brilliant. Good. That's good. And then raising animals. Robin, the local carpenter, lives north of the town. In exchange for raw materials, and money, she'll construct new buildings on your farm. You'll need her to build a coop or barn so that you can raise animals. Okay, cool. She sounds delightful. Let's see it pass now. Yeah. Okay, okay. Well, before I continue, I am just going to hit the be right back screen. So, don't count anywhere, guys. I'll literally minute or two. Oh, I'll see you in a sec.
Okie dokie. I'm back. I just realised that's fine. I thought the time was going to actually uh, escape from me then, but it's all good. It's still the early hours of the morning. No, it's not early hours because it's 7.20, so it's the morning. Let's say that. It's the morning. Shut up, Steve. You don't know what you're talking about. Lol. Let's go and see all these fish. I won't do any more fishing. Because uh, I think I'm going to harvest some raw material and head up north so that carpenter can build me a coop or a barn. But I'm going to have to wait here till 9, aren't I? I've got a slot available, so I might as well just do a bit of fishing while I wait. Oh, that was quick. There we go. We caught our thumbs and hearing. Might as well go again. See if uh, anything will double up. <laughs> Bit of seaweed. Lovely. Nine o'clock. Let's let's go in. <laughs> I keep throwing my fishing rod at it. Oh, he's not here yet. The shop's open, but no one's in. Excuse me, sir. Let's go outside. She might not come in while I'm in there. How oh, item though? I dropped earlier. The sap is still there. Where are you, man? <laughs> what are you doing? Stop doing that. <laughs> bait. That's bait. Come on, where are you? Open the shop. I want to sell me fish. Don't tell me it doesn't work on a Saturday. I have a horrible feeling that this journey was wasted. Especially with it being the weekend. I've got a feeling it's closed, but yet the door's open. Why? But why? Hmm. Have I met you, mister? Sebastian, I don't think we have. Ah, you just moved in. Right. Cool. That's lost and found. It's the pub. It's just a house, or yeah, it's just that's right. It's these, those two guys' house, the elderly couple, uh, Pierre's. It's <laughs> not thrown for sure. Was so tomorrow is Lewis's birthday. Let's see if we can go and pay a visit tomorrow. Hello, Abigail. Yeah, I'm sure I spoke to you. What about you, sir? Oh, I can't say anything. What a shame. But that's the backpack I want. What's this? <laughs> oh, let's keep throwing my fishing rod. He's done it again. He's done it again. Toast of England. Hello. Hi. Hello, kids.
do 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 do. Have I spoke to this lady? Haley, I don't think I have. Alright. We must be getting quite close now. So yeah, we need three more to talk to. And at least that challenge is complete. El completio. Kids come. Hang on, don't boot me off the swing. I thought the kids picked me off them. Picking on me. I thought they kicked me off the, the swing. I know there's a few buildings around here that I could uh, go in, so not there. Or bring us home. I'll stop throwing your fucking fishing rod. Bus stop. Pelican Town to the right, yeah, that's, that's quite clear. So that's actually my place. Mile gaff. Let's head up north. And I'm sure assuming Sunday's gonna be even worse. I saw a cave then. Hmm, interesting. locked only Maru's friends can enter I spoke to you haven't I Demetrius yeah I do remember you I can go in though and is it some sort of shop uh, construct farm buildings coop so we'd need 300 wood 4000 G oh my god and a barn is 6000 well we won't be completing that anytime soon. Ah, oh, for goodness sake. Can you uh, buy anything off me? Wood? 122? Yeah, I'll take that. Cool. Robin or Demetrius live here then? That's Robin there, isn't it? Yeah. Bedroom here, Sebastian. So, this is the place that will build me a barn or a coop, but uh, I literally do not have the funds right now. I spoke to him, I know that. Keep pushing the wrong button. So that's a railroad just popped up, which we're not going to just yet, obviously. What's this? You know, I'd rather just swing something. At least <laughs> pushing the right button. It's a leak. Let's eat the leak. Yum yum. Look, there's a cave. Now, why are you putting water on it? For goodness sake. Alright, let's um, let's check out the cave. Not been in the cave yet. Don't know if there's anything of interest in here right now. 
obviously this house, this building here, is under construction. Or, I say under construction, it's a complete mess. I'm going to bed. I'm off to bed. Yeah. So it's 5 4. We really get up at 7. Fishing. Does that mean what I had in my inventory is sold? <laughs> no, I still got those. Birthday, I think, today. Or was that yesterday? Hello, Silla Blitz. How you doing? Is it my first time playing? It is. And I literally have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> but I've kind of got an idea of what I'm doing, but I'm just like trying to save up money to buy a backpack. I need 2000 to get the first backpack in, at Pierre's. Mm. Yes, thanks for stopping by. Silly Blitz. How's it going your end, mate? Uh, what we yeah, set the board. Yeah, it's Lewis's birthday today, so I'm sure I saw him here in this house. It's locked. Opens at 8. So if we just hover around until 8. Just saw your tweet, can only stay in for a second, wanted to drop in. Uh, that's absolutely fine. Absolutely fine, mate. Appreciate you stopping by anyway, saying hello. Much appreciated. Hope you're doing well on your football manager save. I did a stream yesterday and we did really bad. The plan is Hamburg. Trying to get him back into the Bundesliga. And we did really bad. We we played nine games, I think we only won two. But the stream before that, we won nine. So it's just one of those weird events. Yeah, this is a great game for sure. It's quite fun, it's charming. Yeah, there's something about it, it's quite, it feels quite addictive. I've literally only bought it today, so just learning the ropes before I do a stream for it, why not? Okay, yeah, so can I get in here yet? No, that's. That's not Lewis. That's George. <laughs> Ouch. Yeah, FM can be streaky. It literally was a case of that, yeah. Good old winning run and then didn't change anything and then just went on a bad a bad run really. Yeah, like I said, that, that is part of football manager fun. Make sure you uh, mix your tactics up a little bit. Change things around. Where is Lewis? Nope, don't he's in here. I think um, my brother followed you the other day on Twitter because he's also doing learning about game development, and uh, I noticed that you are uh, you've been learning a little bit about game development. So I popped him over to your page. I uh, played this maybe 10 to 20 hours a few years ago. It could definitely eat up the hours. That's good. Nice little time killer. Mm. I spoke to her yet. Jodie, yeah, I spoke to her. Uh, I still need three more people to talk to. I'm trying to find... Lewis, I can't remember where he lives. Yeah, that's right, yeah, connected. Yeah, he's my brother. Uh, actually, he's my twin brother. <laughs> We're twins. Yeah, he's literally just started up that as well, so that's good. Hopefully, we can, you can help each other out. Do 
didn't roll, didn't realise that. Nah, that's fine, man. Obviously, yeah, like I said, it's the only, <laughs> it's the only time I've mentioned it, really. But yeah, I just, like I said, I did see your tweet, and it just reminded me that my brother's doing it as well, so I thought, I'd uh, show him your page, and yeah, you know, yeah, it's what it is. It's all about community, isn't it? So that's what I like about the football manager community. Everyone's just like super helpful and they're happy to ch just chat and watch your videos and just have, you know, a bit of a laugh, really. Yeah, I really enjoyed Football Manager at the moment. I think it's a case of finding the right people on Twitter. Because as you probably know, a lot of Twitter can be quite, um, how can we say, poisonous. That makes sense, but yeah, it's literally like you said, finding the right type of community, really. The old FM community is the thing that surprised you the most. Yeah, I've only, oh, there is, I've only been using it for a couple of months, and yeah, I was really wowed by it, you know, people, the way they, you know, react to everything and talk to you. Got to find the right pockets, yeah. Yeah. So, this is birthday, but he doesn't mention it. He's very humble. Can I give him anything? Can I give you a fish? Oh yeah, it's my birthday, thanks. Mm. I don't want to let me talk to him anymore, I don't think. Well, that wasn't a complete waste of a Sunday. That was my aim for the day. To find him and talk to him at least. And I managed to give him a present, so that's cool. And then Vincent's birthday, I don't know where Vincent is. Pretty sure I spoke to her. Yeah, there we go. Let's go and see if the fisherman is back in his stall. So I need to sell my fish. Like I said, I just want to get 2,000. Good luck with this and get in the backpack. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Zilla Blitz. Yeah, appreciate you popping by, saying hello. Yeah, much appreciated. And yeah, hopefully, I'll talk to you soon again. Cheers, mate. Bye bye. in this one so I can actually sell so we're not far now 230 away from getting our backpack so I'm trying to figure out where the museum is now because apparently this ornamental fan you can tell you more Gunfa can tell me more about it if I donate it at the museum that's another thing that reminds me of Animal Crossing actually you donate the old fossils you, sir, have we spoke? Sam, yeah, I think we have. Oh, see, look, if I did this, I would have realised. We're looking for museum. I'm sure I've seen it. Blacksmiths. There it is. Oh, I got excited and clicked away. Do this. So we want to head east. Okay, cool. Well, I'm glad that's there on the map actually. I wasn't also using that to its full effect. <laughs> no wonder I couldn't find anyone. It's not this one, is it? I'll pop in here anyway. Oh, something's going down here. Ah, there he is. Good stuff. Abysmal. Not a single piece in the entire collection. Well, I might. Have something for you, mister. What's this? You found something? Let me see it. Oh, I suppose so. Remarkable. It's very old. I love to study this in great detail. But it is yours. Too much you can have it if you want, mate. Hmm. 
got a fair to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We can make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows? If you keep donating, donating I might come across interesting items to send your way. Um, yeah, well, I suppose. Think about it, will ya? If you decide to donate, just bring your objects to the front desk. Okie dokie. Now to buy a backpack. Good for asked if, I'd, if you'd consider donating any new artifacts or minerals. Good job I had it, really. Sweet. What are these books? Can I do anything with them? Ah, oh, they're missing books, aren't they? But most importantly, let's get to the shop before it closes. Yes, yeah, head west. And then that's in the square. Because the shops close at 5, I believe. So at least if I can get there. Although, where am I going? Yeah, that's right, just keep going west. There it is. You're going the wrong way, aren't you? You're going the wrong way. Up here, up here. Yes, there it is, there it is. Yo, Pierre, I want the backpack. Yay! We got it. Should have 24 now. Oh, is that 24? Yeah, 24. Good. A lot better. So now we yeah, can actually carry my items, make more money to sell things. Sunday has been a successful day. You have we spoke? Pam, yes, yes we have. And that's grumpy Alex, isn't it? No, he's, he's getting better. How about you have some fibre? <laughs> um, okay, thanks. Another one? No. So you can only give one gift a day. Yeah, he's been really grumpy, this guy. Every time I speak to him, he's like, get out of my way. So, hoping to cheer him up. What, you want to talk to me? I'm busy. Well, yeah, I was going to chat to you, but if you're going to be a dick about it, then no. No, I won't. So we need to craft a square, yeah, a scarecrow. I was going to say a square row, a scarecrow. That's what we need to craft. But I think we're going to go to bed. Oh, it's early. It's like what? It's nearly six o'clock, six p.m. But it gets us ready for Monday, and then I can head up north and um, try and craft. Can I craft here? Okay, there's no nothing to craft there. Go to sleep for the night. Yeah.
I don't actually have any seeds or anything. Yeah, reach farmer level one and craft scarecrow. Well, let's pick out all these anyway. The ones that are really. Maybe these need more water. Because, uh. I don't think I can pick them out yet. But I might spend this day also clearing out some of the land. I think we could probably clear a bunch of this if I use the wrong, use the right thing. That is. I don't even know what I'm doing, do I? Is it a sky? Yeah, that's the one. Chop down a few trees. They seem to drop a lot of stuff. Obviously, this will drain my energy. So that gives us sap and wood. So let's head up north again. Let's see if that shop was it Gus? Anyway, see if he uh, allows me to um, build a scarecrow with him or craft. Should I say a scarecrow? I'm not certain. But it's worth a go. See, to make sure I've spoken to him. Maru. Is it Gus? Demetrius, completely wrong. I tell you what, Mar Demetrius, you can have a sap. That's disgusting. <laughs> Sorry. And a present for you? Yuck. You thought I would like this? Oh, they don't like that. What about mixed seeds? No, I think I've crossed the line today. I don't think I want any more white gifts. They are not happy. Right, um, shop. Wood, stone, windows, chairs. But well, I can't buy anything. So wood's obviously worth two. Fiber's worth one. Scarecrow in this bit. Slime hutch. No, so that must be something I can craft myself. If I can increase the size of your house and add a kitchen, it will cost 10,000 cheat and it will also need to provide me 450 pieces of wood. Well, 
Yeah, I'm interested, but I don't have that kind of money. But let's sell that to begin with. Gives us a little extra, at least. Reach level one and craft a scarecrow. Now, do I have to get to level one first? Before I craft a scarecrow? The scarecrow. I nearly said it again. Scarecrow. 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 Crafting recipes to increase profit and make life easier. Scarecrow, for example, prevent crows from yeah snacking on your crops. Oh, I just need to speak to three more people. Can I complete that challenge? That's all I want. It's just three more people. So I can build gates and fences and a chest. Maybe I should get myself a chest. So if I pick up 50 wood, let's do that. Let's chop down a tree. That normally gives you quite a bit of wood. Go on, It also gives you a lot of sap. Those are people. Dimitri and the other person, they were absolutely <laughs> offended that I gave them sap as a present, thinking about it. It is a bit weird to give someone sap as a present. So I'm a new kid on the block and they're going to think I'm an absolute weirdo. And they're probably right. <laughs> I don't feel exhausted. Well, we've got 52 wood now, so hopefully we can craft ourselves a chest. Yay! Cool. Ooh. Oh, I can change the colour of it as well. That's cool. Yeah, I like that one. So, no, actually, tell you what, we're going to plant the seeds. The sap. Is that something you can. Ah, oh, look, minus two energy, so if you eat that, it's poisonous, pretty much. That's a seed. That's a, f yeah, forage. Tool, resource, raw material, resource, yeah. Parsnips. Okay, so I'm going to actually plant, I'm going to put the sap in there, and you know what, the parsnips can go in there as well. Cool, 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 I don't need to play around with that. Yeah, here we go, something a little custom, that. Alright, uh, seeds, seeds, there and there, and then... Let's just give him a little water. Cool. And his energy is pretty much depleted. So I'm just going to smack a bit more wood and then go to bed. 
He's exhausted. Zero out of 220. Yeah, look how slow he's hitting that pine tree. And now he's at walking pace, so that means he's absolutely knackered. Oh no, he's going to fall asleep. Oh no. 4.40. He's fallen asleep in the, in the farm. So the act proficiency has gone up. Tree sometimes drops seeds. Good. And we've managed to craft wild seeds and field snack. Good. Good. That's alright. That's, that's probably a quick way of doing it then. Just knack yourself out completely and you'll wake up next day in bed. Legitly, we thought that was snow then, but it's. Eeds. Hey, lots of parsnips. Oh, well, parsnips are good now. Yeah, I don't quite understand the sap at the moment, so. Where's the hoe? There it is. Yeah, the hoe. So immature. Okay. I don't think I have many seeds. Now, I can craft, but do I have the right things? No, I mean, acorn I've not even seen yet. I haven't seen a pine cone or maple seed. And then. That's quite an ask. Horseradish, daffodil, leeks, and dandelion. Okay. Alright, we won't crop it just yet. What if we spend another day clearing up our farm? We've got, got a letter. Dear Mr. Sam Crow, last night a Joja team member found you incapacitated. So someone did pick me up. A medal team was dispatched to bring you home safely. So we're glad you're okay. You've been billed 13G for the service. So there goes my answer to my question. Who brought us home? It was the medical service. And that cost us 13G. Now I wonder if it's a case of the further you are away from home, the more it's going to cost to get you back to bed. You know, I'm even tempted just to try it out in a minute. But at the same time, I don't really want to be losing too much money. And I'm trying to save money to buy a Cooper or a barn. Let's get ourselves some wood. Actually, I think that was a tree I was working on before we passed out. Maple seed. Talk of the devil. We were just saying that I haven't seen a maple seed before. And another one. Alright. Let's break some of these rocks. Using the right tool would definitely help. So that's where the coal come from as well. Can I hit? That's alright, you can hit little bits of weed with it as well. No, I don't. <laughs> no, don't throw water in the water. You dumbass. Can I move places? Because I just feel that. Having the tools next to each other would make things a bit easier. Yeah, good. that's good. Okay. And I think that number two should be stone, definitely. Yeah, because I don't use the hoe quite so often, so two is wood. No, it's not. Two is stone, one is wood. And then one, yeah. Yeah, that feels a bit more natural. Oh man, I'm nearly out of here. It's a big stump. 
Ah, yeah. Just one done. There we go, we've got some more sap and an acorn and some wood. He's starting to feel exhausted. It's, it's not even midday, and he's a uh, he's pretty lagged out. But I'm gonna try and chop this chop this tree down before he passes out. <laughs> but then if I pass out, which he's about to, I'm gonna have to pay a fee. <laughs> but at least we can now craft the scarecrow. Which is a good thing. Alright, bear with me guys. And we can also craft a basic fertilizer. Does that make your crop grow quicker? I wonder. Do, do, do. Got inventory, look, 24 spaces. It's beautiful. Oh, hello. Who are you? Marnie. Hello, Sam Bro. You see this dog, yeah? Yeah. Oh, you do. I see the dog. I think found it sitting outside the entrance of the farm. I think it's a stray ball thing. I love it. Hey, um, do you think this farm could use a good dog? Yes. Yes, I will. Choose a name for the dog. Any suggestions from the stream? What can I call my dog? Hmm. I'll leave that there for a minute if anyone's got any ideas. What to call the dog? So we're about to adopt a dog. So any ideas are most welcome. current dog, not that I'm going to call it my current dog, in real life is called Ozzy, but I'm going to make this dog different to Ozzy, just trying to think what I could name the dog, I don't think anyone's got any ideas for the name of the dog, so I'm going to go with... Jeff. My name is Jeff. No, I can't call it Jeff, can I? Jeff's not a dog's name.
this is genuinely, genuinely the hardest part of my day, is to name a dog on a computer game. I don't know what to call him. I was going to go Jet, but I don't think that's a fair name to be honest. <laughs> Sam Pro, any SOA references? Um, true. Uh, Jax, yeah. Name off some of the characters you, you probably remember more than me. Although Jax doesn't sound bad, to be honest. Yeah, if you can just name off a couple of the characters, that would sound like a dog. I'll have to Google, if not. I haven't watched it for about a month. No, I'd say about three weeks. What's the um the punky guy? What was his name? He had the like Moican. Do you have Moican? You know which one I mean. Opie, Clay, Ortiz, Tig, Chibs, Bobby, Juice. I think Jack's probably a good shout. It has like a dog sound to it, doesn't it? Is that an A? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to go Jack's. Jack's the dog. Yeah, I like that. Cheers, Gaming City. Much appreciated. Crops, <laughs> and I bet that's about falling asleep again. You're lucky I found you last night. You were unconscious, and someone was searching your pockets. <laughs> Bastards! I've no idea how much money they took because they ran away as soon as I approached. Be more careful. So, yeah, I probably shouldn't keep falling asleep on the job. Hundred and eight. I don't know what I had before that. <laughs> Obviously, probably not that much. So there you go. yeah. Someone mugged me. What an ass. Alright, let's see if we can craft Scarecrow. We need twenty fibre. I know how to get fibre. There's one. I've got eleven, so it shouldn't take too long. and then we can grab the infantry oh we kind of plonked him there which isn't terrible but it's not where I was thinking of having him well, I want to um, I reckon if I put him in my top Infantry. Oh, hang on. What happened there? Oh, I don't know. But if you run into him, you pick him up. So, not exactly what I want. Oh, yeah. We'll plonk him there. Oh, no, no, no. That's not good. Alright, we're going to put him. Let's put him about there. number six then should yeah but will that pick him up again when I get near him oh no 
we've managed to resolve that now. So, unless I click on him, he'll pick him up, I guess. But I haven't encountered any crows yet. Okay, cool. Okay, advancement. Let's collect our hundred G. Good, good. Build a coop, say yes. That's quite a way because that's about a thousand G, isn't it? Introductions. I need three more people to talk to. And what's the dog do? What's Jack's? What's he up to? You know what, for the rest of the day, I won't fall asleep. I'm just going to start clearing a few things around here. Seed, doesn't it? So, so I can't take out these big tree stumps because uh, I don't have the powerful enough axe. Yeah, first impressions. You know, I don't normally play this type of game as such, but yeah, it's something about it. It's, it seems quite addictive in a way. I do like the old uh, grindy build your home base kind of game, so it's got that going for it. Yeah, it could be a bit of fun, something to mix up. You know, in theory, I should be playing the Xbox Series X. Get yourselves one of those and then been playing games like this. Oh, what's this? A geode. The local blacksmith can break it open for you. Ooh, interesting. Again, what were we in England? <laughs> I lost my favourite axe. If you find it, please return it ASAP. I'm having a tough time about it. There's 250 in it for whoever finds it. Accept the quest. Yeah, let's do it. Last time she remembers using it, she was cutting wood south of Marnie's Ranch. So, around here, I would assume. So that looks like a little bridge there. Yeah, you know what? I can do that. Oh, I'm feeling in a friendly mood. The 
probably bought it anyway. Uh, I suppose it's just best to do it just in case. What can I craft before I leave? Fertilizer improves soil quality a little, increases your chance to grow quality crops. Yeah. Yeah. Why not? Let's go and use some of our crops. Actually, I should be able to buy a few, do a few of those. put in there but I won't use it anymore just wasting it so I don't even know if I'm <laughs> doing it right right let's go south of Marnie's ranch that noise freaky got ourselves some fiber Too big to break. I don't know if uh, rocks and um, wood grow back. Yeah, I think they do actually, because I'm sure I could get through your last one. So, here's Monty's Ranch, south, she reckons. Hopefully it's pretty easy to get to, or it's very visible. I don't think... No, it's just a spring onion. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to carry too many things. Oh, there's a sewer. get through there by the looks of things. <coughs> I wonder if, it, if the sewer is accessible. There is that. That's the one. You found the lost axe. Better return it to Robin. Now, if I remember correctly, Robin... Does she work in Pierre's? Got a feeling she works in Pierre's, so I might just pop there. Oh, excuse me. You want to made off? It's abandoned house, I haven't. Can we go in it? Mm, it's boarded up. I can't smash the door open here, but. Do the chick right now. Well, I'm heading a bit offwards anyway, to be honest. Close last time. I'm not sure I spoke to these guys. Purchase animals? I can't just yet. Uh, Jazz, I have spoke to her, yeah. Okay. Not much here at the moment, so. Oh, ew, it smells.
Why is it locked? I want to explore the surface. The old dungeons. I think Gunther has the key. Professor Gunther, the man who runs the museum. Why do you think he has it? Saw a big rusty old key fall out of his pocket one time. Creepy sewer door like this has just got to be a match for a big rusty old key. <laughs> yeah, stuff in there. Oh, there's something moving around in there. <laughs> They're scared. Here comes Rambo. <laughs> oh, what's happened here? Oh, going into a little. I thought we were going into a cutscene then, but. We'll come back to that. We need to get the key off Gunther, don't we? Now, where was Robin? I'm sure she was in Pierre's. No, I know where she was. She was at the carpenter's shop, that's right. That's the one. So let's head up to the carpenter shop. Oh, is there not a shortcut around here? Another scary abandoned building. Yeah, it must be here, right? So I think I'm slowly getting to grips with the game. There she is. I've got your axe, Missy. No, hang on. If I go around there, I can actually talk to her, can't I? Hey, you found my axe. What a relief. I almost chopped my toe off with the other one I was using. Thank you. Sweet, that should give us, what, 250? Good, good, good. And this is Maru. I plan on spending a lot of time with my telescope this summer. Sounds good to me. And to buy a barn or a coop. I need yeah, 4,000, man. Yeah, so 4,000 is the, the lowest rate. Allows you to cut and store grass for your feed. A mill, shed, fish pond, cabin, home for a friend, subsidised by the town's agricultural fund. Another home for a friend, stable, slime hutch, shipping bin, throw items inside to sell them overnight. Now I know what that is. Right, yeah. Houses for coop dwelling animals, for barn, provides a well. Okay, so. 4,000, I think, is my first task. I wonder if he's still angry that I gave him um, sap. What about parsnip? And I want to give him parsnip. Thank you. <laughs> it's a very interesting specimen. You're quite welcome. And pass it for you. Thanks, this is really nice. So I, I can sense the sarcasm. Maybe they'll mock me. Mm. Shop. What can I sell? Not a lot. 260. Oh. 58. Not much. I'm going to keep that. I'll need it when I need to craft anyway, so. 
So what can I do? Skills are slowly rising. Okay, and objectives, build a coop, and yeah, talk to people, but like I said, can I go up there? Or was that the railroad? Railroad that was closed down because of yoga, yoga, or wherever it was. Yeah, that'd be. I can get up there. Well, there is a cave there. If I can get down there, could be interesting. Yeah, one of these things again. Was that a raccoon? What are those noises? Oh, there's a building here. Let's check this out first. If I can get in it. Adventures Guild. Proven adventurers only. Alright. That's what's so rude about it, man. I don't know if say hello. Anyway, let's see if we can enter the cave. Marlon. Hmm. You're a new guy. I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably good ore down there, but a dark place to undisturb so long, I'm afraid. Ore isn't the only thing you'll find. You're quite right. Here, take this, you might need it. What is it? Doom. You received a rusty sword. Name's Marlon, by the way. I run the Adventurers Guild right outside. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself, and I might think about making you a member. Nice. All right. Number five. Is my rusty sword. Right, let's head down. Does anything break these? Stone, and this is more stone. Oh, so we've got a health bar now. That definitely means there's baddies down here. Hold up. Oh, look at that. A little slime ball. Oh, he's going to jump on me, wasn't he? <laughs> we killed the little slime. Slime man. Bug meat. Tasty. Oh no. Uh -huh. ah. Come on, one more. That's another one done. <laughs> they look kind of cute, to be fair. To be fair. Ourselves a cave carrot. And found ourselves some copper ore. Ow. Just eat it, really. Oh, 
how do you how do you get him just to eat it? Surely you'd have to pop into the top ten row. Eat it. Come on, eat it. Eat the carrot. Hmm. Do I really need to put it up there to eat it? The carrot. Come up a little bit. <laughs> I actually want one of these little slimy things as a pet. We've got two left. Slime. There's some more levels. This isn't the last level. Probably should have come in with full energy though. This way. You're looking the wrong way, man. food in here. We've got some amethyst and nothing in there. My first dungeon. How fun. Last time these just went down easy. Just like that. Just like that. Actually, I don't need to fight you, there's nothing up here. This place looks more interesting, to be fair. Updated. Reach level 40 in the mines. Okay. Oh, we're in level 5. Oh my god. Well, this certainly isn't going to be easy. <laughs> so sometimes you just take out an enemy and it puts you onto a new um, level. And again, please. No, not, not so lucky that time. But if we can find lots of food, then that is also pretty good. Oh man, I wanted food in there. Why you do this? Hmm? Why you do this? Alright, so where's the ladder? Don't tell me you've got to go and mine everything. Just to find the ladder to the next level. Yeah, it's starting to get exhausted now. Oh dear. There was an elevator, wasn't there? Then, or was that the? Uh... Yeah, it was the floor below, above. Leave the mine or do not. Yeah, I'm gonna have to leave it. That's good though, at least it takes you straight to the top. Can I get on that? Out of order. That is out of order. Yes, I know you're feeling sleepy. And I'm gonna try and get you to bed. But just bear with me, man. Don't fall asleep, whatever you do.
I wish I could bring my dog to the dungeon. I think I might just uh, get home, which I am now. Go to sleep. And I'm up. No, he's falling asleep. I was going to say get to bed and then maybe think about ending the stream. But things haven't gone well here because he's falling asleep. And I don't know if we lost any money. That's going to be tricky. Get into level 40 of the mines. Are you here to tell me I'm Clint? I noticed you've been breaking some rocks open and finding ore. That's good. Yeah, it's good. If you want to get the most out of the ore she finds, you'll need a furnace. Right. Just as it happens, I had an extra set of blueprints lying around here, so I wanted you to have them. Nice. Good lad, good lad. Learned how to craft a furnace. The furnace allows you to smelt metal bars. The bars can be used for crafting construction and tool upgrades. Sounds good to me. Consider having me upgrade one of your tools. Okay, I'm gonna take it easy. See you later, mate. Right, stop watering the letters. I see you've been exploring the old mine. You've got the adventure spirit that much, I can tell. If you slay ten slimes, you'll have earned your place in my adventure adventurer's guild. Last night, a yo-yo team member found you. I was filled 45 for that time. Last night, it was only 13. Another letter. Tomorrow, we're holding the Egg Festival in the town square. You should arrive between 9 and 2 if you'd like to attend. Yeah, I'll try and pop up that if I remember. But can we craft anything? The furnace. No, we need a bunch of copper ore. And we only have three, so... So yeah, we've made it to that point, so I think I'm going to probably end the stream there. Quite fun actually, it's more enjoyable than I imagined it was going to be to be honest. Let's have a quick look at some quick look at these missions, craft a furnace, and wrong button, initiation, yeah, 0 of 10 slimes slain. So yeah, I'm going to leave it there. So. For those that pop by and said hello, and even just watch the stream, I'd like to thank you for popping away, I really appreciate it. But uh, until next time, take care, and goodbye.